latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Kevin Holmes. Here are your 41 Action News headlines for Christmas Eve. Safety protocols in place at KCI to manage the surge in travelers over the holidays. More than 100,000 people could go through KCI just this week, and that's about a third of last month's total passenger haul. A violinist greeted travelers with a performance that took them by surprise. That violinist is a Delta Airlines employee at KCI and has been playing music for Delta passengers for five Christmas Eves in a row. How sweet it is. Depending on whether you live in Missouri or Kansas, you could get hundreds of dollars in financial aid to pay your, your, your utility bill. Evergy letting people know federal money is available to people in need, and in order to qualify, people must meet income guidelines and show proof they're responsible for paying the utilities. If you live in Missouri, you can apply now. In Kansas, you can start applying January 4th. The deadline in both states is set for March 31st. In the midst of the pandemic, breweries came together to help each other. Crane Brewing Company in Raytown helped create a new beer to raise money for other breweries in the state. That money raised will go to the Missouri Craft Brewers Guild. The goal of the guild is to support craft breweries in Missouri. And if you'd like to buy this beer to help, we have a link in the web link section at KSHB.com. Gary Lezak with your forecast. Hey, Kevin, we're looking at an interesting storm system developing early next week. What does this mean? Well, rain, freezing rain, sleet, snow. It looks like the winter types are shifting farther and farther north. So we'll monitor closely as we get closer to Tuesday. Between now and then, oh, 8 degrees, 19 degrees at 10 tomorrow morning, double that to 38 degrees at 2 o'clock. So it should feel pretty good by the end of the Christmas day. Seven day forecast, 59 Saturday, 51 Sunday. Looks pretty good at Arrowhead and there's that 70% chance on Tuesday. Remember to get the news and weather anytime at KSHP.com.